What's up guys, it's Toby with Condor Blue, and in this video, I'm gonna show you how to install our brand new Canon R5C Cine Cage. Let's get into it. The R5C is a major upgrade from the R5, not only in image quality and dynamic range, but also in physical controls and connections, such as the timecode port. So to honor the cinematic focus of this 8K beast, we've added key details such as a sensor plane marker for accurately measuring focus marks when using a manual lens, an open left face to leave access for drop-in filters and popular RF lens adapter modules, and multiple points of contact making this our strongest mirrorless cage yet. Some other key features of this cage include a front-facing accessory mount, perfect for a focus motor when paired with our airy pin rod clamp, and our redesigned HDMI clamp for peace of mind while shooting, which I'll dive into more detail about later in this video. Now that we've gone over some of the features, let's unbox and install this bad boy. In order to install this on your camera, we'll need to separate the cage into these four segments. The top plate, bottom plate with the left and mid rails, the right plate with the lower bracket, and the Ronin Arca Swiss plate. If your cage arrived fully assembled, please take a moment to separate the plates into segments using the included magnetized hex key on the bottom plate. Now we're ready to put it on the camera. Let's start by taking the bottom plate with the left and mid rails and line them up with the camera, ensuring the tongue on the left plate slides into the eye loop. This provides a snug, no wiggle fit for the cage. You may have to do this at a slight angle to get the mid rail over the camera sensor. Just make sure the mid rail sits flush with the body before moving on. Then we'll use the quarter 20 mounting screw to secure it into place. There's also a small anti-twist bolt you'll want to tighten here, so don't miss that. This will also need to be unscrewed if you plan on removing the cage. Next, we'll install the right plate with the lower bracket by inserting it into the groove on the bottom and fitting the tongue on the upper right into the eyelet hole. Then use two M2.5 bolts to secure it. Now the top plate should slide right on top. Insert the six bolts, two at each joint, and you're good to go. The Arca Swiss plate provides excellent functionality with DJI gimbals and with our upcoming 501 to Arca pivot camera plate. To attach, just line up the ruler side of the plate flush with the bottom plate and insert the two provided quarter 20 screws. If you own the version with the top handle, just loosen the thumb screw depress the safety release pin, slide it onto the top NATO rail, and retighten. Lastly, insert the included cable to take advantage of the remote trigger function. And be sure to set the switch on the front P. Now we all know the micro HDMI port on the camera can be an Achilles heel. One good bump in the cable connector and your port is destroyed. But our new built-in clamp prevents this by cinching our cable connectors against the cage underneath. Just loosen the two screws on either end, plug in your cables, and while pushing and sliding the clamp back against the cage, re-tighten the screws. This will keep your HDMI firmly secured and your port protected. The USB-C section of the clamp does not cinch down, but does provide a robust frame preventing any potential damage from accidental bumps or force. If you're looking to rig out your camera even further, we have several pre-built kits and complete rigs to get you ready for production at any level. The Canon R5C cage is built for versatility and ease of use for productions of any size and is available in both Space Gray and Raven Black. Be sure to explore all of the Condor Blue ecosystem to further enhance all the features of this one-of-a-kind cage. I'm Hobie with Condor Blue, don't forget to stay creative.